Aujourd'hui, être orfèvre et joaillier, c'est... To be a goldsmith and jeweler today is not very simple, in the sense that a goldsmith's trade has always been more associated with the art of a table than anything else, even though a goldsmith works objects, decorative objects and all these kind of things. There are jewelers who work with stones, there are other jewelers who work with metal, and again other jewelers who work with both stones and metal. I would say that we are goldsmiths, stone jewelers, and metal jewelers. C'est devenu une passion, mais plus par les rencontres, par le fait d'avoir un. It became a passion, but determined by meetings, by having done this job in a staggered manner, thanks to my father, Mr. Robert Goussens, who, with Mademoiselle Chanel, invented this discipline in our business called jewelry couturier, or what the Americans call fashion jewelry. It is a fashion jewellery, which before yesterday was only a copy of the real jewels. Here, they are made an accessory in their own right. We have really an accessory to the real important thing is, of course, to stay on. It's a duty. The important thing is to stay on. I think it is a duty from the moment when we have been working in a traditional manner with the technical, artisanal knowledge instilled in us which we had been taught to transmit and to be the guarantor, but at the same time, we have the duty to evolve with the times. I said not long ago, we have our right foot in the past, head in the present, and our left foot in the future. This one here is one of the last creations of only a few months, but rather inspired by the Vikings, by warrior bracelets, it is hammered as we played with the effects of gold.